What we can see clearly, and we work with well over 40 institutions globally, is in 2024, and actually this began in 2023, but there's two things that are gonna happen. One, live transactions. And what I mean live transactions is transactions that occur in a blockchain that have real value involved. If you're issuing a bond, it will be worth, say, let's call it $100 million of real value rather than testnet transactions. Some of these have occurred sporadically, but they've typically been in pilot environments. But the difference now is that we're shifting to production deployments. Particularly banks are taking the leading role in deploying their own platforms. Some that are you know, relatively well known globally, Goldman Sachs, uh, Broadridge, which is a technical provider, and many, many others, um, including Citi and HSBC, have all made announcements around their particular tokenization platforms. They believe that this opportunity is coming. So 23, 24 is really about putting in that base level foundation. Then what we see happening in 2024, 25 is catalyst transactions, not just one-off transactions, but verticals, particular types of transactions, starting to move real volume onto these particular platforms. Uh, so not just one-off transactions by any means. So one that is publicly well known is Broadridge and their repo platform. Um, so they have over $70 billion of transaction value that goes through that platform every day. And that's blockchain based. And so this will just replicate itself over a whole range of other different verticals. And once you have those catalysts in place, then we believe 2026 onwards is the, the point of acceleration. 